Now this is um, the Jewel, this is South Africa's first electric car. It was designed by Optimal Energy, which is um, a Cape Town based company. The car is, it was designed and built in, in South Africa. It's completely South African innovation and it's a, it's a fully electric um, car, which means it's got it's battery operated. You charge it from a, from a wall plug and uh, you know, then you can drive with it. We started in 2005. Uh, four engineers came together and were looking for a, for a transport, sustainable transport solution. They looked at all the different technologies you can, hybrids, uh, you know, um, fuel cell cars, uh, all the different technologies and electric was found to be the way to go. Well, electric cars are definitely the buzzer because of, of, of climate change. Um, electric cars are zero emissions vehicles and if you charge them from a sustainable source, like a solar panel or a, or a wind turbine, then it's a completely zero emissions vehicle from you know from charging right through to its use. And also, if you're looking at a, a, an industry that's based on, on transport and um, that's based on being using oil, which is uh, not a sustainable resource, you need to start looking at some alternatives. If you look at hydrogen; it's, uh, it's still a little bit expensive, and um, you know, still storage is an issue. Uh, whereas electric, with the infrastructure is already there as well. You know, we haven't had electricity around for hundreds of years. So it's, uh, it's something that can be implemented straight away. Well, it's basically it's very simple to use. You can plug it in with a standard three-point plug into, a, into any wall plug. Basically, all you do is you take your charge connector, this drops down, and you plug it in here. This goes into a standard wall plug. And then it charges. So it's very simple to use. If you, the idea is to come home at the end of the day, plug it into your wall plug in the garage and just charge it overnight. Obviously it's a car that's much simpler to use than your, than your normal car because you never have to go to a fuel station to fill it up. You can basically charge it from a standard wall socket. So you come home, you plug it in, it's got a lithium ion battery which recharges. It takes about 8 to 10 hours to charge from, from completely empty and uh, gives you about a 300 kilometer driving range. And um, you know, so it's, it's a very easy car to use. It's only got a single speed gearbox, so it's like an automatic vehicle. Put it in to drive and off you go. It's obviously very simple to use. It's like a normal car, it's just more, more convenient and a little bit easier. You've got a, an accelerator pedal and a brake pedal and a, a drive selector. When you push it in to drive, it, it's ready to go. This is your electric park brake. And when you release it, it's as simple as that. You drive it, you drive it off. It's got all the functions that you expect in a normal car. It's got a radio, a DVD system, it's got an aircon system, and that all your um, displays in the front will show you your range, how much energy you've got left, and um, how much energy you're using at that stage. The important thing about electric cars is we need a, a transport solution that can run off a sustainable fuel, and a transport solution that's zero emissions. And that's what makes electric cars so important. The fact that they are zero emissions vehicles, and also the fact that because if you, if you can't use oil anymore, you need a different solution. You can generate electricity in sustainable ways. You can generate it through, through wind power or through um, solar power, and that makes it completely sustainable. You know, having a transport solution like that, be able to use in cities where 80% of your pollution comes from personal transportation. You know, that's already a big step towards uh, combating climate change. The Jewel will be the first mass-produced um, electric vehicle in South Africa. So the idea is to uh, get it on the market from 2015, pricing you're looking between 250 and 300,000 rand um, in today's relative terms. And then we at this stage probably look at a, at a lease model for the battery. Um, you know, to, to lease it on a monthly, on a 